guys so it's the next day and I still have the boxes out and these are the Christmas boxes they're stackable they're inside it's two other box different sizes and I purchased these there from Steinmart when they were going out of business for five dollars the ones that were put together with the bowls they were ten dollars so I got the one that wasn't put together because I knew I would take them down not only that the ribbons I don't know if they knew that but the ribbons was in the package I bought six of these from Steinmart that's the cone and I have them stacked to store I have a special place already for them right here is just one part of the kitchen that's the um, small island and all the Christmas stuff is down this right here is a pot that I found outdoors um, about a few years now and um, and um, I decide to spray it was black and I decided to spray it back black so all the Christmas but for this cup right here this cup set I'm taking it back to I think TJ Maxx I have the receipt inside of it I love the black I love what is happening here I'm gonna take these down <clears throat> but <clears throat> excuse me want to do a bit of a winter decor I think I'm gonna leave this ice bucket here out and do some type of decor over here this is how the table is looking I decide to put this out because I want to do more salads and have this available for my um, oils or vinegars um, I have one of my trivet on here this right here is I thrifted this for a dollar and change and this right here um, these are the glass globes for like your bathroom or so and I just like them so I um, got them from the thrift store for like 10 cents and to use them for the holidays a little bit of greenery I bend one of the um, how you call it one of the I forget what it is but you could get them from the Dollar Tree in a pack and I I know the name but it can't come to me yes so I put this around here to kind of fill at the bottom so this is the closed in patio halfway closed in patio and it look a mess so right here is my um, the sofa table was well, not really a table um, console table and these here were DIYs this here is a DIY I have the video for it and everything is mostly cleaned up let's look over here um, I closed the blinds down in this light I have the I had this light outside and in the winter I brought it in and I put um, a garland around it getting ready for my winter decor I actually put it up before I sweep and um, let me put it on and show you actually I will just go ahead doing what I'm doing because I could get sidetracked so easily I left some of these picks out these were thrifted I left some of them out because I want to do something on my fireplace I left some of these out here too another um, you know a little cheapy cheapy garland this right here it's um, I just made this and I use one of those ties I cannot remember the name of these wire ties that's the same concept that I show you with the um, bathroom globe so I did this here I don't know where I'll put it um, don't know if I'll take this up yet because I want to do a winter decor this was part of my Christmas decor and this is a lantern this is a lantern in uh, urn and I these all of this is like picks that I put together this little table right here I actually found that table outside it was brown and I sprayed and I painted it with chalk paint and um, I'm about I purchased these knobs here these knobs here these glass knobs from um, Joanne's fabric and I'm about to put the glass knob it came with some metal knob let me show you the same knob these are the same knobs This is how they look and they are mercury glass so I'm gonna keep this out this is an easel I was thinking about putting a, a mirror or a painting on it 
it has like birds. I leave it up all year round. It has like birds and the easel framing is made out of something that looked like twigs. I also have a tray to match this. Ooh, I might bring that tray out. Yes, you just give me an idea. So the fireplace is all, all the stuff is taken down, but not cleaned up. See, and I show you guys that I put glass on my fireplace and because I don't want the paint to peel off with the constant wiping of when you put the sticky hooks to hold them together. So these are some remnants down here. This right here, believe it or not, I found it in my neighborhood in the garbage. Yes, she garbage hunts. <laughs> this right here, this is another light. This is, um, I thrifted this piece here. It's similar to the other one. And that's why I want to leave it out. And this is how it looks. Actually, it was green and I spray painted it. So I still have, I still have um, some of my picks out. And I put all my picks in one um, bag like this. This is a, I guess you will store clothes in here, but I'm using it for storage and I'm glad that it has that front. So once I take down, you know, once I take this down, I know all of the picks that I own um, with the evergreen. It's in here and the red berries. Um, I have some more upstairs. I'm going to put them in here to, to, to nestle everything together. You know, time is money, right? <laughs> so these right here, I'm going to show you what I do with this and I wash them all up. That's my, um, the only thing that I did not wash was the red pillows. I plan to take them out and I have a, I have another insert that I want to put in it, but because I'm putting up red for the year, I try to store all like-minded items into the same packaging. So once I open it up like this tree skirts here, there's, let me show you. Oh guys, this is a lovely idea. So I got these from the Dollar Tree. I was going to make a pillow out of them, right? When I couldn't figure out my color scheme for this year. So I was going to make a, a pillow, bought two. So I said, let me, let me just put these two together and I'm going to make a, a lumbar pillow. But then I got it home and you know, sometimes you just want to lay on your couch and you don't want, you know, where's the most worn part on a couch most times is the arm. So I use, I had this out, getting ready to make a pillow out of it. And I'm like, oh, let me cover this because I had just washed my hair. Look at this. And what I did was I just put it on the chair arm to just lay down and rest my head. And when it's not in use, I just fold it like this. And I told the family the same thing too. So everyone was doing it. You fold it like this and just stick it on the here you know the pillows going you just stick it in the corner so the next person come and they need to they want to just lay up because this is the family room you put this right here so the oils on your hair or your neck doesn't get on onto the the arm of the chair making it look ugly so that's a cute tip <laughs> it sounds like i said a cute tip right so i'm gonna go ahead and clean up and then start with my my um fall no did i say fall i'm backwards with my um winter decor so this is how it's looking for now let's put this together <laughs> excuse me so guys i uh have these storage bags right here this i got it from ollie's and what i do is i put like all like-minded items like gonna put these away because there's no need for them my towels whenever i'm using this color then i know well i'm using traditional colors i know where to go directly and get just what i have i also have another packaging like this with them but this is a new packaging that cannot fit in in the other one that I have. So I'm gonna open up a new one. I also have these right here. This one here could fit two, two um, king size comforters. So I love getting these storage bags 
This one here could fit one comforter. And then this one here could fit two, could fit a ton of stuff. And then you zero them out by using your um, vacuum. So let me, well, let me show you what's here. Tablecloth, got this dish here. Stocking, this um, poinsettia um, runner. This is how it looks, it's long, it's doubled. So that's this, the two pillows. Then I have another pillowcase. And um, this is tree, a tree skirt. Also, I have three of these blankets right here. And three of the red and green and white blanket with black. And then I have three of the red plush uh, blankets. And I, in the earlier I told you about the cones, I mentioned these to you. I paid $2.50 for one, and I told you I got six of them. So let me go ahead and put these um, into the Ziploc bag and close everything together so I could stack them away. This is a tip that you could use for your own stuff if you are limited with space or even if you just want it just neatly put away it's all washed and clean and good for the next whenever you're ready to use it so let me put them in a bag and show you how i could zero out everything so now i'm gonna lay the bag down on the coffee table and i am using I think a 24 by, can't remember the other size, but um, I really fell in love with these bags and I'm able to store like a lot of things. And you know, with the having things to have a house really clear, you wanna have everything neatly and keep them out of the way. And right here, that helps me, especially with things that I'm not going to use for very quite very often so I'm gonna put in the blankets first and the pillows and all of that and now I'm gonna use my vacuum cleaner to suck out the air and you see it is pulling very fast and this once you're done you could stick it under your bed you could put it in an attic you could put it in your garage is all protected and it is seal tight so guys I'm gonna start my cleaning now that I'm finished throwing up all my things and come back in the next video and I will show you what my winter decor look like not gonna do too much just a little bit so guys if you like what I'm doing here please like subscribe and share also give me a big thumbs up that really helps my channel and I enjoy sharing my tips and tricks with you guys so please come back bye bye